making his way out to the hexagon at ESC Africa 14. Adam, the prodigy, speechly, 24 years old. He loves this. He loves body on the big stage. And he's a super talent. Follow him at Adam Speechy on Twitter. Look at that. He is so pumped. He is so chilled walking through Costas fans. Just not a single worry in the world. You know, Adam lost his title to Dallas Jacoby at Welterweight. Got the opportunity to drop down to lightweight. And he's really, this is the right weight division for Adam Speechy. He was never outclassed by, by Dallas Jacoby. Dallas is just able to really overpower him in that weight division. Nothing taken away from Dennis Jacoby in that fight. Adam Speechy, though, is not the strongest, toughest guy at welterweight. At lightweight, though, I think you'll definitely find himself a better place. Adam Speechy, of course, looked after by Peter Smith and Attila Barna out of four ways in Johannesburg, a southpaw. How is that going to affect the likes of Kostiyanu? Well, we know Kostiyanu trains with Gareth McKinnon, who fights the southpaw. So he's definitely, in terms of his preparation, he's had a couple of guys that would uh, fight southpaw. But there's a big difference when you also start thinking, guys that are not naturally southpaws, they don't naturally grapple southpaw. It's, it's, you know, things are so very, very different for, for the guys. And Adam Fischer, we've said this in the past, a couple of years ago, people said his, uh, his stand-up game was one of his biggest, biggest flaws. But we saw the Dallas Chicago fight as well. He landed an incredible right hand. He's very unorthodox and very sneaky. And coming into this bout, he's very, very confident. Supremely confident. And he's got a Bachelor of Health Science degree. He's now decided to go into physiotherapy. He's following in the footsteps of his dad. He's with a Royal Challengers bungalow on the IPL. That's Adam Speechley.